Henry Ford, the visionary father of the modern auto industry, grew up on a farm outside of Detroit. Maybe that's why he designed his Model T to run on ethanol alcohol, a fuel made from corn. White lightning, moonshine. Ford's alcohol captured 25% of the fuel market in the Midwest. Now when he did that, red flags went up at Standard Oil. John D. Rockefeller, the founder of Standard Oil, started funding an amendment that would become known as Prohibition. That one law shut down all alcohol production in the U.S., including ethanol alcohol. For 12 of the 13 years of Prohibition, Ford continued to produce ethanol-compatible cars. And then he gave up. 